Hi guys, I'm General Chaos and I'm back with another video. Today it's part of my long running series now called General Chaos Draws. Today I'm going to be drawing Aku Aku. Alright, so without further ado, let's get started. So, um, the first ever Crash Bandicoot game I ever played was Crash Team Racing. It was like this really, uh, like this, uh, like illegal copy of Crash Team Racing, because uh, you could tell it was, because I don't know. The screen was like partially green, so everything was like in a green tint, and I don't know. It, and you know, the, it, it was the disc wasn't like um, like the official Crash Team Racing disc either. It was uh, like I said, it, it was it, you get the idea. It was obvious that it wasn't uh, an official copy, you know, whatever. Probably already fucked up the amount of like feathers that Aku, Aku has, but to be fair, the amount of feathers Aku, Aku has always seems to like change. It's like it's like Sonic, you know. He's never it's never the same like. Um, the same model that they use for every Sonic game, it's like slightly different. You know what I mean? But anyway. Draw his eyebrows, like big rectangles, then draw his eyes. And yeah, really simple. Then his nose is like kind of pointy, it's like a Waluigi nose, only not that pointy. And then you've got his mouth. I forgot how his teeth go actually. Um I think his teeth are, for the most part, just sort of, like, rectangles. Sort of, like, wooden, I think. Well, whatever. Um, now let's colour him in. Uh, normally I'd start with a, like, black outline, but I think this time... This time I'm just going to get straight to the colouring. I'm going to do the black outline later. Um, I think technically my first ever, like, Crash Bandicoot, like, game, not, not just, like, kart racing or spin-off, was actually Wrath of Cortex. And then it was Crash Bandicoot 2. Uh, then it was Twin Sanity. And, believe it or not, I did actually own, in fact, I think I still do own, um, Crash of the Titans and Mind Over Mutant. Because what I'm about to say now might sound kind of controversial, especially seeing as I was the internet and everyone apparently has to have the same opinion, or else you're yeah, branded a hater or a traitor to a franchise or whatever. I actually kind of liked what they did with uh, Crash of the Titans and Mind Over Mutant, even though technically I'd say both were kind of the same game. In fact, I always thought both games should have been really the same, or Mind Over Mutant should have been like a DLC or something, but anyway. Um, I, I kind of liked what... Um, you know, like I said, I liked what the game did, what those games did. They had Crash trying to hijack them with uh, Aku Aku, and he could, like, gain their abilities, and he could use the enemies in the levels to, like, traverse, like, traps and other whatnot. And I, I must say, that's, that doesn't really sound like all that, that big of a problem to me. Like, I always kind of liked that. But, eh, whatever. The one thing that I didn't like about uh, Crash of the Titans and Mind of the Mutant, I think, there were times, especially with, like, Coco, where they tried to, uh, they tried to be, like, really hip and trendy when... You know, all, all the series ever really needed to do was just to be, like, true to their audience, if that makes sense. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to have this, uh... I may have actually fucked this up. Just to give him, like, sort of, like, pupils, like, small kind of pupils, but, uh... I don't know if that's just going to look really stupid now. But, hey-ho, sometimes it's... Sometimes it pays to, uh... Go above or beyond the boundaries of what you know, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. I really don't know what I'm talking about now, so let's just, uh, let's just colour Aku Aku in. Um, what I'm going to do is here, and as it's going into the centre, it's getting more and more yellow, if that makes sense. Actually, now that I think about it, I could probably could have just skipped the whole green pupil things, but I always thought it was kind of weird, Aku Aku never having pupils. It's like, how does, how does he see? I mean, I know he's got them eyes, but no pupils? Like, how does he physically see things? Um, hmm. If there's one thing about uh, the Crash franchise that I'm not particularly fond of, it's Bash. I like the idea behind Bash, and I like what Bash tried to do, and I love the great Bash levels. But that game, I think, is just too hard for its own good. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like a challenge and everything, that's not the problem. My problem is... I, I, I just... I think Mr. Jum and Team Martinez is going to know what I'm talking about here, because, you know, you, you did that Let's Play, didn't you, Jum? And, you know, it's like... The game went so overboard with the difficulty, you know? Pull the rest of his eye in now, I guess. No idea what that Twitter notification says, that tweet. Looks like it's in another language that I can't understand, but whatever. Right, um, oh yeah. I suppose I'll colour one of his feathers in now. Fuck. Make sure you actually record. Chaos. You no, know, that's what people came here to see. You drawing something and then colouring it in. 
Right, um... Now fur purple. Because I know one of his feathers is purple. Um... And that's it. Uh, well, Stone's Claw is facing and everything. Um... Uh, oh yeah, blue. Bang, 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 bang. I'm gonna do with a fucking hammer outside. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna... That might actually look kind of nice, actually. Because it could, like, contrast his feathers or whatever you want to call it. I don't know what I'm saying now. Uh, I've got a dark blue here. Yeah, there's like little patterns in the in the feather. Right, I'm gonna detail them as well though, don't worry. Fuck off. 20 percent I don't care. see that. I can see it there. Um, I really don't think there is a lot to say. Um, today has been kind of raining for the most part of this morning and then as I was leaving it's uh, actually got better again. Kind of weird really. Um, apart from that there really isn't a great deal left to say. I'm gonna call his uh, yellow feather. Hmm. So I could just call that in red as well. And I've already called this orange feather, you know, the pattern in the middle, red. But yeah, whatever. Right. Um. I suppose I just call his masking now. Then I'll go over everything else with a black pen. Fucking hell. Um, I really don't have a great deal left to say. Um, so that just shows you what kind of life I'll be dating. I know, uh, why don't we just have a, like, a little random question you guys can tell me in the comment section. Alright, um, what do you guys think about Team Fortress 2? Do you think it's a good game? Are you already, like, a massive fan of the game? Or do you, or would you rather play something like Overwatch or Battleborn? I mean, that's fine, if that's absolutely fine if you do. I'm just interested in what you guys have to say. Leg on my bed, and it's a lot more awkward for me. What did everyone think of those um, Crash Bandicoot games on the Game Boy Advance? I've heard a lot of people said they really don't like them, but uh, I never really had a problem with them. Uh, I wasn't particularly fond of those skiing levels in Crash 2 Entrance. I didn't really like them. Awesome grey. his teeth in. I will say this, I love um, Greg Eagles' Akuaku voice, because I think it kind of sounds like um, what the Grim Reaper sounded like from Grim and Evil, like, like in the very early episodes. Which he actually does a really good like, Akuaku voice. And I didn't mind the original voice he gave Akuaku either, where he basically just copied and pasted his Grim Reaper voice either, because his Grim Reaper voice is pretty good too, but uh, I, I could just, all I could hear was the Grim Reaper from the Grim Adventures of Billy Amanda. Not necessarily a bad thing, but not necessarily a good thing either. But like I said, it's not a bad voice either, so whatever. Right, before I colour his face in, I'm gonna go over gonna go Waku Waku with a uh, black pen. Put the details in his feathers. Uh, 
Oh, this is taking a lot longer than I uh, thought it would. I'll be completely honest. Not that good at drawing feathers, but uh, whatever. The whole part of the series for me is just to have fun. But yeah. Right. and then redraw the lines in his teeth. <laughs> you know, as I, the more I look at it, the more I think I've given Aku Aku like a Squidward nose. Hey, Crash! Check out my clarinet solo. Probably the worst Squidward impression I've ever heard. Right, uh... Let's call the rest of Aku Aku then. And uh, I think I'll be calling him in brown. Cause whatever. Just so that, because I'm calling him brown, it meant going over him in like black, you know, just to bring out some of the. This is just a detail in a bit so I didn't get confused. I keep thinking I pinned myself. I saw something on YouTube about. No, sorry, Twitter even about how YouTube had apparently demonetized Cadicurus's videos. Like, deemed them like, unworthy for. Ad advertising or whatever, and apparently 60 of his videos have been like copyright striped. Not very good. Uh, I think Caddy'll Caddy do something about it. I mean, it's not like he has barely any subscribers at all. He's fairly big, he's fairly well known, so I, I imagine he'll, he'll be alright. But you know, it doesn't hurt to uh, keep helping those in need. I mean, Oh, we're almost finished, ladies and gentlemen. Then they'll finish, then I'll just uh, compare my drawing with an official like, image on the internet. Can't see fans on there. Yeah, I think he's uh, coming along fairly nicely. I think, I mean... I think. I think, the I think you know, the details brought him out a bit, like a wacko. And that's it, we're done. Yeah, we are done. All right, let's uh, just give you a full view of the picture. Bow note, by the way. My cat sat with me on my bed. Hello, weeps. Hello. Hello, darling. Hello. All right, so uh, here we go. Now let's compare it with an official picture from the internet. Hang on. <sighs> Turn the fucking brightness up. That would help. Right. Official pictures. My picture. Close enough. I knew they were supposed to be green. The outlines around his face. Fuck. Apart from that, uh, I think I got the colour scheme of his... Uh, of his, like, feathers wrong. I also forgot his green goatee as well. <clears throat> Well, anyway, um, join me in the next part when, uh, I don't really know what I'm going to be doing for the next part, um, <coughs> excuse me, I think I'll just keep it a secret until, until when I next 
come up with something. Um, unless, of course, I get a request from anyone, then, uh, you know, that'll be what, what I get requested will be what I draw in the next episode. But until then, I'm General Chaos, and I'll see you all later.